Hello and welcome. I'm Bridget Young Linehan and today we are going to be drawing a unicorn. But not just any unicorn. We are going to draw Bjorn, the last unicorn. This is a brand new character created by Pencilish Animation Studio and you can watch the very first episode of this new cartoon at Pencilish Studios at YouTube. So I will leave a link in the description box. But right now, let's learn to draw Bjorn, the last unicorn. So here we've got his head shape and a muzzle shape. We're adding on some nostrils. And so let's go to the eyes. You want to try to make sure the eyes are even and balanced. Now, just because your first line isn't really what you want doesn't mean you can't go over it. At this stage, what I basically do is pencil sculpting. I kind of go over the line and over the line until I get a shape that I like. And then later, you'll see that we'll knock it back with an eraser and then choose the line that we like the best. Ordinarily, you'd want to do this stage in a lighter pencil, um, something with a harder graphite gives you a lighter line. Unfortunately, on a video, it, it's such a light line, it's hard to see. So I'm using a softer pencil, which will be harder to erase, but that's okay. And we put some cute little pupils, or iris, and... Although on cartoon characters, I kind of like it where the whole thing is dark, and on this character, it is. It's not really divided into an iris and a pupil. It's just a dark round circle or oval and high eyebrows that are kind of like big commas. And then the horn. Now I'm kind of drawing off the camera here. Sorry about that. We'll adjust that here in a second. And then some ears. And he's got some cute little perky ears there. Yeah, and, and you can go ahead and erase lines that you know you don't need anymore. And that kind of helps you to visualize what you're drawing as you're drawing it. And just keep trying things. If you don't like something, you really don't like it, you can erase. There's no eraser police. You can erase. It's okay. And then give him a little frowny line, but then we're going to change it into a smiley line. It's in these three segments with the little cheek lines. And we're going to do these cute little teeth. I love these teeth. They're a little offset. Yeah. Gorgeous. Okay, so the mane is really cool. Um, it's going to be, we want it real full and curly. It's going to end up being um, a rainbow color. And so the mane is a big part of this character, besides his cute little face. And I really encourage you to head over to Pencilish Studios at YouTube and watch this cartoon episode. It is just really cute. More will be coming soon. and and other cartoons from this studio is going to be coming. But this character is just the cutest character. And I wanted to bring this character to you. Um, it, it's in a simplified version, of course. But the simplified makes it easier to, to kind of learn to draw the character. And then as you practice, you can you know, make it more complicated. And as I look at it, it's not exactly the Bjorn, this version, but it's kind of my, uh, we'll say it's Bjorn the Last Unicorn in my style. How's that? 
It's a cute little face, isn't it? And it's fun. It's fun to draw cute little characters. There we go. You can see the top of the horn there. And here we are knocking it back with the eraser. And then when you go back over this, you can choose the line you like. And you can draw it. You know, you don't want to trace the lines. You want to try to draw them again, although that takes a bit of practice as well. Now, I have practiced with some inking, but today for this part of the project, I wanted to use pencil. Pencil is a little easier to control. And at the end of the video, you'll see some versions of it where that I've inked. So you can get a nice little line with the black. These are Prismacolors that I'm using. And of course that big eraser was a kneaded eraser. But all the pencils, the colored pencils, are Prismacolors. And this is the black. And you can kind of practice inking with the pencil, you know, to get the feel of it, and then graduate up to a brush pen or a micron. This is the Mono Zero. Um, eraser. Now I really love this because it's so small and you can get into little areas and not erase away too much. Just get those little areas. I use this all the time. I love it, love it, love it. This song is um, I dreamed of purple unicorns. And I got this off Epidemic Sound. And here we go with our colors. Now, they don't use red, they use a, a you know, kind of a dark pink. I've got the colors as close as I can with my pencils, but if you want to run over and watch the cartoon, you'll see what I'm talking about. But he's just so fun with that rainbow mane. And then his main colors are light pink and blue, kind of cotton candy colors. And of course, you know I've speeded this up. <laughs> Having fun with stickers. We love stickers. Who doesn't love stickers? And darkening up his eyes. Gives him that cute little look, and I couldn't get that pencil to stay there, but we got it. Beautiful, cute little face. And now you're going to get to see some of my other attempts. And just keep practicing, you know, because when you practice, you get better, and better is good. Thank you for watching. See you next time.